was supposed to be a really good day. The best of days. The Germans had surrendered. The war was over. <laughs> or so we all thought. None of us were really that keen on the plane, you could tell. We all just wanted to be back at home with our families and our friends, smiling and laughing, embracing strangers on the streets, cheering with all the crowds. But that wasn't to be. We were given this last mission it was supposed to be over. And then the sky erupted with all these explosions, these huge, deafening crashes and blasts. Do you hear that? And the shouts of men on out there? turning into screams. Oh, fuck. We're ducks. Sounded bit like a war, the war that we were told was over, it was all finished, and we were just going to clear it up. And we'd been sent right back into it.
I had plummeted through the air, desperately tearing at my parachute. And I somehow woke up hanging from a tree. The plane had been shot down, but I was lucky. I could see the bodies of men who had been sitting near me minutes earlier, dead on the ground. Planes were still flying overhead. They seemed to be getting closer. I didn't know where I was, if I was in front or behind the line. But I knew I needed to get down and quickly. I found my knife and started to try and cut through the mess of cords tangled around me. And I managed to cut through them and I fell again. And I landed on my knife. Grid my teeth, pulled it out. Ich hab da was gehört. Ich hab ihn da hinten gehört. Und findet ihn. Thank you. 
Komm mit deinen Händen hoch. Lass die Waffe fallen. I, I'm sorry, I, I don't understand. Come with your hands up. Drop the gun. I, I'm, dropping, I'm dropping the gun. Down on your knees. Okay, go down. Okay, okay. I'm, I'm just reaching in for paper, a letter, letter. Come on. Can you cook? Can you give it to my family, please? Grab your gun. We gotta go right now. Come on. Get up and go. Grab their ammo. Had a pretty little wife. We should get out of here. We keep moving. You alone? Yeah. Hopefully there are others. But we need to get out of here before more Germans come. They're already here. They're looking for you, not me. You trying to get yourself killed back there? Thank you for, for saving me. What are we going to do with the two of us? Probably a 100 Germans out here. Maybe you can't do anything, but I can. But if you don't want to fight, just go. You going to kill every crowd by yourself? Every one of these German bastards I kill means one more of our boys gets to go home. We don't know where we are or how many Germans are looking for us. You. They're looking for you. They won't kill you too? I'm going to get every one of these pricks. They wiped out my unit, my brothers. They wiped out yours too, or did you already forget that? We need to get going. They're looking for one soldier, not two. So I'm going to stay, and I'm going to kill as many of these Kratz as I can get my hands on. Great. Suicide mission. You Yanks have to be heroes. Thanks for helping me out back there. You mean saving your life? Yeah. Saving my life. But now I'm going. Good luck with all the killer. You don't want to go that way. I'm fine.
This is why I'm gonna kill as many of those assholes as I can. Some of them might still be alive. I've got to help them. They're all dead. How do you know? I checked them. One was alive. Barely. You sure? I'm not an idiot. Then why didn't you save him? There's nothing I could do. Just stop breathing. Me. Yeah. Well, it wasn't. You take a good look at them. Because they slaughtered us like fucking cattle. And if we stay here, we'll get slaughtered too. I said you can go. Men were my friends. Maybe now you understand. Why'd you have a death wish? I see you, motherfuckers. Don't creep up on me like that. I could have killed you. What makes you think I wouldn't have killed you? I told you to go. They're all dead. You're the only one out here. We need to work together. You want them dead, I get it. I don't want to kill anybody. But I'll do what I have to. Is your gun loaded? Never actually killed anybody. It's easy when you got a reason. I got a reason, so do you. Yes. If we gotta take them out. If they find those bodies, we're gonna have the entire German army on our ass. Yes. What's the plan? I'm gonna circle around behind them. We're gonna stay here and keep cover. Remember what you're doing this. My letter. Where did you get that? Dropped it on the road.
Thank you. My name's Sidney Baker. William Summers. You're gonna bring them right to us. Shut up and come here. Christoph? Who bist du? Speak German? A little. Oh, like that Gutentag shit? I know that. Gutentag? Shut the fuck up. English. Do you speak it? Do you understand what I'm saying? Nine, nine, nine English, nine. Nine English. He has no idea. He's a dumb We fuck. can still it's use him. He's useless. <laughs> matter with you. We could have used him to get out of here. This is war. Really think he would have let you live? We gotta move. They'll have heard that shot. Yeah, shot you didn't have to make. There's probably Germans surrounding us in every direction Looks now. Looks that way. I know you don't want to live, but I would like to go home and see my wife and child. Stop deluding yourself. You're not gonna make it home. This was always a suicide mission. We can both get out of here if we're smart. Look, I told you to leave, so if you want, you can just go and find... What was that? Dogs. Did you see a dog with this group? No, must be a different group. They don't give up, do they? Well, that's why we'd kill them and don't take them prisoner. Move. Move! Move! <laughs> We're done. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> 
you, little girl. You good? Thank you. Go. What are you doing? Got an idea, you keep a lookout. What was that? I'm getting the dog off our back. It worked. Yeah. You killed a dog. Hopefully. I like dogs. This one would have torn you to pieces. Probably. Think we got them all? If it didn't, it distracted them. We gotta find a place to rest. It's gonna be dark soon. You wanna carry on through the night? No, it's... Pitch black out here at night, you can't see anything. We don't have any lights, we won't know which way we're heading. Do we know which way we're heading now? Like I said, it'll be dark soon. We don't, do we? How long you been married? Just over a year. Little picture.
She's a beauty. They both are. Well, I wouldn't give to be at home with both of them now. What are their names? Um, my wife's Irene and my daughter's Mary. Sounds like you got the perfect little life back home. I do. Or it was going to be. Mary was born just a month ago. I got leave for the day. I had to hold her. And I'm back to maneuvers. You'll see him again. see him again. You hear me? What about you? What about me? Any girlfriend, wife, back home? I mean, you must do something else other than kill people. I'm not a killer. Just doing my duty. Yeah, yeah, I know. I didn't mean anything by it, honestly. You know what I was before the war? No. I was a mechanic. I fixed things and put them back together. I didn't. I'm just trying to kill people who are trying to kill me. If I didn't do what I did back there, you'd be dead too. I was a train engineer. It's good enough for the effort until now. Maybe we should try and get some sleep. Yeah. I'll go ahead and try. I'll take first watch. Trockness, Holzpiete. 
Ja, ja. Schnell. Ist gut? Ist gut, danke. Scheiße, Achtung. This is the best plan of action. You ready? Achtung, schnell, bring the waffle. Let's go from here. Schneller. Klaus, antwort mir. Oh, Klaus hat ihn Freunden. <lacht> Klaus? Klaus? Scheiße! so long to shoot. I had to wait for the right moment. You did great. Thanks. Let's not do that again. Exposed. Keep your eyes open.
What happened?
I can't do it. Thank you, your little girl. We gotta go. We gotta... <coughs> what? No. What's wrong? You're fine. You're fine. You're fine. You gotta go. You, you gotta. You gotta come with me. You're no. killing them all. No. Remember? I'm not gonna make it. I got a family. Can you? Can you, can you get this to Sarah? Can you tell her I tried? I tried real hard. And my boy, get, the, get this to my boy. His, his name's Jake. You tell him I tried. Your family.
I was in the middle of God knows where. No, even he didn't know. Alone, exhausted, with the single thought of trying to get back, whilst wanting to curl up in a ball and give up. But I put one boot in front of another, and another, and then, Wait, 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 wait a minute. I'll leave. I'll leave. I'll leave. Just, just let me go. Drop it, raw food. You have a family. I have a family. Drop it now. Nobody has to get hurt anymore. Let's put our guns down. You really want to do this? I didn't want it. He didn't leave me any choice. And I think that was you, I think. Thank you. I'm going to 
gun shot and all that silence. I went as fast as I could to escape to get out of that damned forest. To get us home. I came across this barn. I, uh... <laughs> I talked to a horse. Hey, boy. You're a good horse, aren't you? friend, he, he told me not to. He's a bit of a pillock, really. <laughs> and the owner came in and I readied myself. I thought I was going to die again. But this man, this barn owner, he hid me, he grabbed me, and he hid me. This Dutch barn owner. These two Germans came in, they must have tracked me. I was never as good at this as Hello? you. And then he managed to get the soldiers to leave and fly after a ghost.
Thank you. Are you, are you all right? Say I'll never surrender. Who hit you? What is your name? I'm, uh, I'm Baker. Engels. Yeah. Take me in the race. Yeah. Hungry. Hungry. Eat. Yeah. Yeah, I am. And then he fed me. He put me up in his home. And when the war was over, when it was finally finished, when the fighting had actually stopped, he got me back to Britain. I owe two people my life. A stranger of a Dutch barn owner. And you, an American soldier. The best of men, Private William Summers. I wanted to come and see you for years. But after the war, I was terrified of flying. This is the first time I've left England. I tried to contact your family. I really did, I, I tried, I promise. I brought my family. My little girl, grandchildren, and, and I had a son. He's here too. I know I haven't got much time left, and it's only because of you that I'm here at all. Thank you for giving me my life. Not a day goes by that I don't think about what you did for me. You gave me the courage to fight when I didn't think I could. Thank you, my brother. May you rest in peace.